Hey guys, and welcome back to 511 Ministries. I am Kiara, and if this is your first time, I welcome you to my channel. And if you're coming back again, thank you so much for your continuous support. Today, I just want to touch the topic of dreams. The way that we can hear from God, I want you to know that there are different ways to hear from God, but I specifically want to talk about dreams. A lot of times, God speaks to his children through dreams. When you go to sleep, right, your, your body is physically, it looks like you're almost like dead, right? When you look at someone that's sleeping, it's like they're zoned out. That is because your spirit is awake. Your spirit is awake when you're sleeping. So when you're dreaming, you're in another realm. I want you to know that you're in a whole different realm. So pay attention to your dreams. God is showing you things in your dreams. He's trying to hint something to you, but you're overlooking it, especially if you have a repeated dream. He is trying to get his message across to you. If you keep seeing the same dream and there's a message in there, please write it down. Keep a journal. Write down your dreams because trust me, it will help you with key points to life. God is speaking to you through your dreams. So write it down and use it as a reference and go back to it. Things might not make sense for you now and whatever your journey is, your situation. But if you write down your dreams, there are going to be key words. There are going to be images that you remember. Write it all down. If you've seen a dog, if you've seen a cat, if you've seen you by a bridge, if you just whatever it is, because I know dreams could be extremely weird at times, but it means something. There is significance in that. And I do dream interpretation too, but we're going to get deeper into that as time passes. But I want you to, for now, write down your dreams. And if you are a person who cannot dream, I pray in the name of Jesus that whatever is holding you back from seeing the visions and remembering your dreams, I pray against that spirit in the name of Jesus. And I pray that it is released, that you are able to have dreams and remember your dreams. Because a lot of times we wake up and the enemy has us not even remember what we dream. Like we know we just came out of something, but then we don't remember it. And that's because the enemy is trying to steal the messages that God is trying to convey to you. And I just want you to understand that. So whenever you wake up and you don't remember the dream, ask God to please bring it. Ask Holy Spirit, please bring me back the remembrance of what the dream was last night. And trust and believe he will give you little insight. You'll get little visions throughout the day of what the dream was. And I want you to write it down, okay? So God bless you. Again, write that down and we're gonna get deeper into that. I'm gonna be doing videos about what dreams mean and what God is possibly trying to tell you. All right, have a great day.